So multiple sclerosis affects nearly a million people in this country. It disrupts communication between the brain and the body and can trigger a wide range of physical and mental challenges. Joining us this morning to share her journey living with MS is dancer and choreographer Courtney Platt. Courtney, good morning. How are you doing? Good morning. Thank you for having me. My pleasure. Thanks for spending a few minutes with us. Um, I'm reading that you were diagnosed with MS 10 years ago uh, when you were on So You yeah. Think You Can Dance. Tell us a little more about that experience. Sure. Um, so like you said, I was diagnosed 10 years ago. I can't believe it's been 10 years. Um, but the first question I asked my neurologist was, what does this mean for my movement? How will it affect my dancing? And she said to me, the greatest thing for you to keep doing is to keep moving and keep dancing and do not stop. Um, so that was uh, music to my ears. So when Bristol Myers Squibb asked me to be a part of the MS and Harmony Initiative, it was a, it was a quick yes for me. And tell us a little more, if you don't mind, about this uh, MS in Harmony, the, the exercises, playlists, and such that you can find at the website. Sure. So Bristol Myers Squibb MS and Harmony Initiative is the first ever uh, digital music therapy resource uh, specifically curated for people with multiple sclerosis. Um, there are interactive videos led by board certified music therapists. Um, they include vocal warm ups, dance exercises, which are my favorite, um, guided meditation. I have never been one to uh, to meditate, but put it to music and I was a uh, led by i actually had a, such an amazing experience with one of the music therapists and um yeah it's just there's a there's there's a spotify channel um that there are customized playlists that are specifically curated by the music therapists and so it's just a really amazing thing that i'm just so excited to be a part of and share with everyone yeah it sounds like a, a, and i'm just looking at the website a lot of resources there for folks do, let me ask you something do you, do you think people have to be a, a musician or a dancer to do these modules in the ms in harmony or do you think it's for anybody no it is for absolutely everyone um like you mentioned before ms symptoms can be mental physical emotional all of which music can help um Music therapy is not a substitution for medication, so super important that you surround yourself with a good team and find the treatment that's right for you, but it, it really has such a positive um, impact and can help in many ways. You know, one of the, one of the specifics uh, examples I can give is, you know, even something as simple as creating your grocery list, you know, some of uh, memory loss is one of the cognitive dysfunctions. Um, and you know you create a song around your grocery list and it makes it easy to remember um there are speech issues associated with multiple sclerosis and i had to do a bunch of vocal warm-ups uh which is not my strong suit so you do not have to be a pro it is for absolutely everybody super fun to get the whole family involved and so so generally it sounds like this has been a, a very positive experience for you and, and using music i guess as as therapy or, or part of therapy um, you know, I, I love therapy and I love music. So put them together in an organized way. It's actually been around for many, many years. And, you know, Bristol really brought it to, to light. So yeah, it is, it's therapy and it's using music and kind of just, um, guiding you in a very organized fashion. And, um, I am, uh, I'm definitely, I definitely use it for sure. Courtney, thank you so much for spending some time with us. Is there a website or a place where folks can get more information? Absolutely. You can go to the website msinharmony.com to experience the interactive videos for yourself. And Courtney Platt, and you'll see Courtney's picture there uh, at the website as well, a dancer and choreographer. Uh, Courtney, thanks for your time today. Really appreciate it. Thank you so much for having me, and stay cool in that Eat. No kidding, right? Boy, oh boy, you were hearing our forecast in Houston. It is rough. Have a great day, Courtney. 